Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, all glory, and all honor to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Shel Ha Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders that rule well, from the men of Great Millstone on down. Also to you, Akim, out there pushing and preaching in the name of Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai. To you, I say Shalom. Also to the one third, hopeful elect, you Ak Akwath out there listening and learning. And to the scattered Israelites among these heathen nations that look just like these heathen nations, but go back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. To you, I say Shalom. So this video is going to be entitled, I Know Who I Am, But How Do I Repent? And the first scripture I want to start off with is Micah 7 and 9. I will bear the indignation of the Lord because I have sinned against him until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me. He will bring me forth to the light and I shall behold his righteousness. So this this scripture right here pretty much tells us the, the condition that we are in right now as a people, you so-called blacks, Hispanics and Native Americans. Right. Who are the biblical Israelites, according to the Bible? Right. We are currently bearing the indignation of the Lord. Right. If you go to Deuteronomy, the 28th chapter, starting at verse 15, there's a list of curses. And, and right now, our nation is under those curses because of disobedience. Right. Breaking the law, statutes and commandments that the Heavenly Father has given us in the wilderness. We have we have broken his covenant, right? And we were made to serve our enemies. That is why we are subject to payments. That's why we get gunned down in the streets. That's why um, you, you have no substance, right? Because we are bearing the indignation of the Lord, right? I'm going to read it again. This is Micah 7 and 9. It says, I will bear the indignation of the Lord. Because I have sinned against him. Right. We are we are in this predicament because we sinned. Right. We sinned against the Heavenly Father. And I, and I got the definition of sin. Right. First John chapter three, verse four, it says, whoso committed sin transgress transgresseth also the law for sin is the transgression of the law. Right. And what is the law? The law of Moses. Right. The first five books of the Holy Bible, you know, the Torah. So back in Micah 7 and 9, it says, I will bear the indignation of the Lord because I have sinned against him until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me. What is the Lord pleading the, his cause? Right. Is when he, he delivers us, man, you know, and execute judgment for me. That's when he judged these other nations for the things that they've done to us, man. You know, while we were enslaved. Right. Because the scriptures say um, they have forwarded the affliction, man. When, when when our iniquity had an end, they forward the affliction, right? It says, he will bring me forth to the light and I shall behold his righteousness. What is the light, man? That light is Yahweh Shai, man. The law, right? In Proverbs, the sixth chapter says, for the commandment is a lamp and the law is light, right? Also, it says, um, uh, for lo, I come in the volume of the book. It is written of me. That's speaking about Yahweh Shai, man. Yahweh Shai is our light, you know? And it says, I shall behold his righteousness. The Lord is righteous in everything that he does, man. So because we sinned against the Lord, because we were disobedient and broke his covenant, he made He made good his word, man. You know, he put those curses on us, right? So the, the essence of this video is, is how do you repent, man, right? And uh, the reason why we 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 uh give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem or Kakwadash, is because the Lord told us to, man. You know, this is uh Matthew chapter twenty eight verse eighteen. It says, and Yahweh Shai came and spake unto them, saying, All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the